final day of our Pelt for Prep for Birth Challenge. And so today we're gonna break down a tip to help you relax your pelvic floor during labor. So we've broken down how to do diaphragmatic breathing so that we can connect with our pelvic floor. We broke down thoracic mobility, so how our thoracic position can affect our pelvic floor's ability to relax. We broke down pelvic mobility. We did a pelvic floor relaxation exercise. And now we're gonna try to bring it all together to know how to relax our pelvic floor during labor. And so one of the things that we can do during labor to help release tension within our pelvic floor is to focus on the pitch of the noises that we are making during our contractions. And so if we do really high pitched noises, so excuse this, this like eek type noise, make that noise and see what happens in your body. You probably kind of lifted up and in. And so really high pitched screaming type noises are gonna kind of clench our body and clench our pelvic floor. But if I do the opposite where I do a really deep low noise, it's gonna relax my pelvic floor. And so try it, try to do that like eek type noise. What do you feel within your body? And then do a deep ooh type noise. And what do you feel within your body? And so you can use that during labor as a quick thing to do to help release tension within your pelvic floor. So if you're having a contraction, instead of being very high pitched and like screaming with it, you can focus on these really deep, low noises. So let's practice it. So we'll do our diaphragmatic breathing where we're taking my big inhale down and out, feel my rib cage expand, my belly expand, my pelvic floor expand. And then when I exhale, I'm gonna do a deep, low kind of moaning type noise. And we'll do four or five together just so you can feel it within your body. So let's come into a comfortable position. Maybe it's a seated position, maybe you're sideline, maybe you're supine, something that you can feel like you can relax into, or maybe you're gonna practice a labor position that you wanted to try. And so closing your eyes, getting comfortable, we'll take our big inhale to feel the ribcage expand, belly, pelvic floor. And then exhale, we're gonna have that deep, low noise. So big inhale. Exhale, release. Another big inhale. Exhale, release. And maybe we inhale for three to four. Inhale, one, two, three, four. And then exhale, maybe double the length. So exhale, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Big inhale, one, two, three, four. And then again, that deep, ooh, tight noise for five, six, seven, eight. And then continue to try that. See how that feels within your body. So let's do it together one more time. So we're gonna take our big inhale. Exhale, release. Ooh. 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 And then just kind of feel how that feels in your body right now. Do you feel a little bit more relaxed? maybe a little bit more grounded. And so use that during your contractions as a breathing technique to help relax your pelvic floor. So I hope that's something that you can utilize within your own birth to feel like your pelvic floor is releasing and letting go to support your labor progress. Mm -hmm.